Hi you guys, welcome back to my IGTV. Today I'm going to be showing you a very quick and easy fuss free makeup look that doesn't take me more than like 5 or 7 minutes to do on days when I don't want to waste too much time on my makeup or I'm in a bit of a hurry. It's only like 5 products I think and I'm also going to be telling you a little bit about the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Matte 24 hour foundation. If you have been following me or watching my videos for like a while basically since I started the L'Oreal Paris infallible foundation used to be like an all-time favorite I was obsessed with it it was all I used and this is their pro matte 24 hour formula that I have been using for like almost a year now and I really really like it so I have three different shades here with me I know my shade but I'm gonna show you one shade lighter and one shade darker as well because they're all pretty much similar but like different undertones and I'll show you all the three shades I'll swatch them on my face for you guys to see and then I'll tell you a little bit about the formula as well before we jump in for the rest of the look so if you can see right here I have my shade which is the one in the middle which is 103 and then we have 104 here on the right and 102 over here 103 is usually the perfect match for me if I'm a little tan I sometimes mix 103 and 104 together or I use 104 by itself but this works really well for me I'm gonna quickly wipe this off and then we'll apply the foundation so before applying foundation or any kind of makeup on your face always remember to prep your skin beforehand I have already done that so let's quickly jump into step one of this look that would be foundation now I have taken a little bit of the infallible on my hand and I'm I might be looking over there because that's the viewfinder but just dotting it all over my face if you remember like the makeup looks that I have shared in the past I've always been a very like full coverage makeup kind of person of course my skin has gotten better and it allows me to use more lightweight foundations so on days when I need like a really quick and lightweight base that also lets my skin breathe this is like my go-to the infallible pro matte I love it it's firstly the shade is a great match for my skin I really like it because like I said it's very lightweight, very breathable, it's also transfer proof and smudge proof and the shade is a really great match for my skin. It's also very easily buildable which works if you have like a few small spots or scars on your face or you want to conceal those dark circles, you just take a little bit more product. So I've taken a little bit more product on my hand and I'll just apply it over here because I have some of the scars showing through. Honestly, I don't want like full coverage, so it's okay even if a little too show through, I don't mind. And I'm taking it under my eyes as well. So I think I'm done. I don't want to use more product because I think this works for like a daily wear thing. It's very natural. It just evens out my skin tone and it's more skin like which I love. The good thing is that with this foundation because it's matte you don't really need a powder to set it in. It doesn't crease and stuff so it's really comfortable. Okay now that my base is done my next step would be brows and I'm not the most confident doing my brows on camera so I'm quickly going to do them and come back but that would be step number two. Okay, I'm back and I had to kind of go a little more bold with my brows because they haven't been tweezed in ages, so trying to shape them was really difficult, so let's not look at these, okay? Next step is blush. Now, if you know anything about me, I love my corally peachy toned blushes and this one from L'Oreal Paris is their Le Bar A Blush in 10 Play With Me. It's one of my favorite blushes. It's in, it's like pretty well loved if you can tell. I use it almost every single day. Just grabbing the brush and I'm pretty much just gonna apply it. There's nothing more to it, to be honest. Okay, so blush done and I pretty much feel like my entire makeup has changed because this just brightens the face up so much. And my trick is, I've shared this so many times before, but my trick is to use the same blush that I'm wearing on my eyelids as well. It kind of gives a more monotone vibe to the look and I just love how it looks. If you can just see, this is all I need to do. This hardly takes like 30 seconds. And um, on days when I wear my grey lenses, which I am wearing today, I think it complements the lenses really well. Okay, so that was step three. Now we have step four, which is mascara, which is my favorite step when I do my makeup. This is the L'Oreal Paris Slash Paradise Mascara. I have spoken about this time and again. It is one of my favorite mascaras ever. It's an amazing mascara. It just completely changes your entire look. You will see. Do you see that? 
so mascara done i'm really sorry for light has changed from when this video started bombay weather i don't know what to say anyway um we have only one step left for the look as you can see by the way the mascara completely like changes the look like i said it adds so much volume and separation and i love it and now coming on to lips we have the l'oreal paris rouge signature lipstick in 121 i choose this is my favorite shade from this range and usually i would wear it like directly with the applicator but because the rest of my makeup is super natural and lightweight like i said before i usually just take a little bit like this and i then apply it with my finger So this is how it looks. I think on days when I like a more lightweight natural base, I really like applying my liquid lipstick with my finger because it kind of pulls the whole look together really well and it doesn't look too stark. I guess if you know what I mean. Anyway, this is the look and I really hope you guys like it. If you have any tricks that you kind of keep in mind on days when you're doing your makeup in a hurry, like I said I use my blush as an eye shadow. Sometimes I use my lipstick as a blush and an eye shadow. So if you have any tricks like this, leave them for all of us in the comments below. And as always, all the products that I spoke about will be linked. Just tap the title of the IGTV video and you can then go directly to get your hands on the products. And I guess that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.